Okay, this is a ready continuous freezer and our capacity, our ability is 300 liters. It can make uh, about 100 to 300 liters ice cream in an hour and you can adjust the overrun with the machine. And now uh, we can introduce some points of this machine, how to, how to use this machine, how the, the function of each place. Today we will start a test at our factory because this is for our customers. So we have to test every machine before we deliver it. So now you can see uh, for the continuous freezer, this place is for the uh, pre-mix. Pre-mix is here. So uh, you have to connect the mix with the machine from this place, from this tube connection. Oh, you can see all our designs are very good, consider the sanitation of the machine and you can see the valves, all the valves is very easy for, uh, to remove, okay? And uh, this place is for control the air overrun, the overrun of the ice cream. And if you turn uh, this spring in the anti-clockwise, you can get uh, more overrun. If you turn this clockwise, uh, you can get the less overrun. So the customer can adjust the overrun by turning the spring. This place is, uh, we call it a safety valve. Okay, why uh, we use this? Because when the inside is over pressure, it can take out the inside pressure. So this is to protect the machine uh, to in case any over pressure inside. Okay, now you see here is the control place for the machine. And this one is uh, different with different switches and for different uh, um, components. This is for the power and this is for the dasher, actually the motor of the machine. Here is for the mixing pump, for the mix coming in. And uh, here is the compressor for the freezing and this is for the defrost. And uh, this is will show the number of the uh, amperes of the machine to con control the consistency of the ice cream. And here is for control the uh, the mix the mix uh, quantity, uh, how much to flow inside the machine. Okay, for this continuous freezer, you can see this place is for take out to the ice cream. And normally it can connect it to other machines like filling machine. Uh, like uh, the modern machine or other machines. And, but here, this is a place to control the velocity of the ice cream. Also, this is very important for uh, you get the consistency of the ice cream. And uh, uh, so you have to adjust it if you want to get a different velocity. And now we will show you how to operate this uh, semi-automatic uh, 300 liters batch freezer, continuous batch freezer. Okay, this is our part for the control. Let's can, we can start. Uh, the machine. Oh, first we start the, yeah, the, the mix pump, mix pump for the first step and let the mix come in the machine. Okay, when we saw the mix coming out from the from the machine, we can start the uh, motor, the the blender. The third step, we start the compressor. Okay, and uh, after that, we have to stop the. A mix pump because we have to make the mix to freeze inside. Okay, now uh, the machine starts working, the motor, dasher, and the compressor working. You should check the amperes numbers on the control and uh, to see how the products inside.
when the uh, amps number, like the consistency of the ice cream is get harder, uh, we have to restart the milk pump. So now the mix come in again. See, these are the uh, ice cream from the continuous freezer, uh, 300 liters we tested just now. And uh, you can have a look of the consistency and the texture looks so fine. Very nice. Freezing, uh, freezing function of the machine. If it's too much freeze or less freeze, you can just adjust it. Okay, if you want to modify the uh, consumption or the result of the ice cream, like uh, from 100 to 300 liters, you can just adjust here to control the mix capacity. Okay, and the least switch is just when the machine is, when the, the product is finished, you have to use this switch to bring the hot, hot air inside the machine, which is easy for the cleaning of the machine. To stop the machine after the product is ready. Okay, first we stop the uh, the pump and then yeah, the, the mil milk pipe and compressor and uh, we uh, we power on a switch on the uh, defrost uh, after the inside ice cream is getting melt uh, less consistency we can just uh, connect to the hot water like uh, say to uh, 70 degrees and to clean the machine. And then we just switch on the dasher. Actually, this is a motor controller to let the water come in and clean the machine. And after the clean, and you can uh, stop uh, and power off the machine. Okay, now you see how we open the machine, and uh, our engineer can show you. Our 